Hello guys, welcome once again to another video. Today, let's take a look at yesterday's record breaker Falcon 9 launch, the progress of the Starship launch pad, and finally, Firefly's Alpha 2 launch. Yesterday, SpaceX completed its 41st mission of the year. This was a record-breaker launch for SpaceX. This mission successfully launched Starlink Group 42, the latest batch of 34 Starlink satellites and AST Spacemobile's Blue Walker 3 test satellite. The first stage Falcon 9 booster used on this mission made its 14th flight, the first Falcon 9 to achieve the milestone. It was successfully recovered for a record 14th time on the drone ship a shortfall of Gravitas. The SpaceX chief was very impressed with his Falcon 9 rocket. Reacting to the latest launch, Elon Musk said that there is actually no limit on how many times this booster can be reused. Generally, this applies to all the Falcon 9 boosters. Often, we wonder how many times a Falcon 9 rocket can be practically reused. According to Musk, as long as the vehicle is working fine, there is no limit on reusability. This is what SpaceX was founded for, reusing the rockets and reducing the cost per launch. Yesterday's launch set another record for the most number of second stage burns in a single mission. The Falcon 9 second stage had to make a total of four single MVAC engine burns to successfully deliver both the Blue Walker 3 and Starlink satellites into their desired orbits, and it will make a fifth deorbit burn to burn up the second stage in the atmosphere. The stacking of Starship Orbital Launch Integrated Tower 2.0 at Launch Complex 39A is almost complete. The eighth section of the tower was lifted and stacked yesterday before launching the Falcon 9 rocket. Just to remind you, the Starship Launch Tower at Kennedy Space Center is currently being built just next to Pad 39A. I predict we will see a fully stacked Starship on this new tower within a couple of years. Back at the Starbase, crews are preparing for further testing on Booster 7. We have a possible road closure scheduled on Monday. Firefly Aerospace is set to conduct the second test flight of its Alpha rocket today. Alpha 2 test flight mission will lift off from Launch Complex 2 at Vandenberg Space Force Base in California. This mission is named to the Black Mission and will attempt to launch multiple satellites to low Earth orbit. The first test flight last year didn't end well. I wish the second attempt brings success to the company. The launch window starts at 3 p.m. PDT and will last till 7 p.m. All the actions from this launch will be live streamed on Everyday Astronauts YouTube channel. It will be an exciting launch to watch. Well, that is it for now. I hope you all have a great weekend, and I will see you on Monday with a lot of exciting updates.